Margie's Fruit Cupboard! Hello! Hello! My name's Anna. And my name's Argie. And welcome to Anna and Argie's Broom Cupboard. Ooh, right, on today's Anna and Argie's Broom Cupboard, we're going to learn how to create a world of food. Wow, I love food and I love the world. <laughs> I love food. Okay, materials list please, Argie. Check. First up on the materials list, we have an A4 white piece of paper. Check. Second up, we have a circular bowl. Check. Third up, we have a black pen. Check. Fourth up, we have colouring equipment. Check. That's pens or crayons. Okay, so first you need a pen and an A4 white piece of paper. Great. Pen. Yes. The lid off. Great. And now the paper. Okay. So, here we go. A4 white piece of paper. So we've got lots of space on our rectangular piece of paper. What we're going to draw, we are going to draw a plate, a knife and a fork. So we're going to put the plate right in the middle of the A4 white piece of paper. Okay, if you hold that please Argy, I'll get the bowl. So I am going to use the bowl to draw around. So we need a circular object to do that. Now, if you haven't got a bowl this size that fits on your A4 piece of paper, find something else that's circular that will fit. Maybe a plate or a compass. You could use a compass if you're very clever. Or maybe you could just do one freehand. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to put the bowl in the centre of the paper and draw around it. Okay, bowl, centre and pen, draw around around the bowl. Okay, there we go, that's the plate. Oh, now, what we're going to do, we're going to draw a fork, a fork, big giant fork. Here we go, four prongs at the top. I'm just going to join up my plate. And then we're going to do a very narrow knife. So knife, handle, just pop a few of those lines along here. So this is like our table mat, our fork, plate and knife. Great! So what's next? Well, we need to think of different types of food that belong in our world of food. Oh, like a world of food, like you could have candy floss clouds, you mean? Oh, I like that idea. Broccoli for trees. Oh, you could have um, uh, you could have uh, crackers for houses. And also biscuits for houses. <laughs> There's many different things you could choose. But I think what we should start to do first is to think about the bottom of our image. What's on the bottom of our image? Well, well, well probably the ground. Oh, that's a good start. Okay, so what's on our ground? Have we got soil? Have we got seeds? I know. We could have salt and pepper on the ground. Oh, that's a good idea. So let's do dots for salt and pepper that we can draw up. That gives me the bottom. another idea. As well as the salt and pepper on the ground, we could also have some lovely green peas on the ground too. Oh, they could be our seeds. Yeah, great. Let's plant some seeds. So these are our, these are our green peas, our seeds, mixed in with our salt and pepper soil. Great. Okay, that's, so that's our ground of our world. Now what's going to be on the top of the ground. Uh, well, maybe we could have some buildings. We could have a building. Now, what shape are buildings there? Mm. Mm, generally rectangular or square. Mm. So what's a rectangular piece of food? Uh, well, we could have some sort of biscuit. Oh, that's a good idea. I love nice biscuits. Okay, so let's do some rectangular shaped biscuits. So they look like a tower of houses all next to each other. Let's do one at the end. Okay, and what about the top of the biscuit shaped buildings? We need a roof, perhaps something triangular. What's uh, triangular? Well, I could think of cheese. Oh, that's a good idea. Yes. Let's pop some cheese. Cheese triangles at the top. Maybe if you like a Dorito crisp, oh. they are 
Doritos. Triangular at the top. So there's a mix of cheese and Dorito triangle roofs. And what about a bit of greenery? Let's have some greenery. Oh, well, like you said before, broccoli trees work a treat. Good idea. There's, here we go, let's draw some broccoli. Lovely. And there's lots of vegetables that look a bit like trees, actually, because really, vegetables are trees. They are broccoli, cauliflower. Well. You could have some Brussels sprouts, oh, like bushes. Oh, that's a good idea. Okay, so what about in our sky, above our buildings? Uh, well, I said before, clouds of candy oh, floss Oh, yummy, 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 great. yummy. So let's do some clouds. Let's do three clouds. Okay. That's nice. And then there's a gap there. And I wonder what we could use as the sun. Oh, I love the sun. Mm. Something yellow and something round. What? is yellow. Lemon. A lemon. lemon. Great idea. Got it. Got it. Here we go. So let's do around the outer bit of the lemon. And lemons are usually in segments. So let's do a segment like that. Great. Ooh, that's so cool, isn't it? We look like we've really got the beginnings of a great world of food. But it's black and white right now. It is black and white which is quite nice. If you like to keep it black and white, that is fine. But also you could colour it in. Oh. So get your colouring equipment, your pens and crayons, and colour in your world of food. Yeah. I'm going to get the one I prepared earlier. Well, I go, am a fan of colouring, as you know at home. Here we go. Oh, great. We've got blue, purple, and pink biscuit buildings. Yum. Triangle cheese and Dorito roofs. We've got the salt and pepper and the green peas the candy floss in the sky, and best of all, the lemon that is yellow. Mm, I think that looks gorgeous and colourful. Oh, I like the purple house the best. I've also coloured in the knife and the fork. Yeah, that's really cool. The best thing about the world of food is you'll never be hungry. <laughs> oh, I like that one, Ardy. <laughs> well, that's the end of Anna and Ardy's broom cupboard. Just so you know, we've created a book, A World of Food, because myself and Ardy love food. Let me just show it to you. So here we go. We've got the Ready Steady Colouring In book. So inside, we look at different types of world of food. So there's plenty of you to cut things for you to colour and to be inspired by. We just love food. See you again next time. Bye. Bye. It's Anna and Ardy's broom cupboard.